think it's going to be a Nolly late heel. Uh, I'm pretty sure Jamie can do those. And I usually feel really consistent about it. So that's going to be the one. When he's on T, like, uh, it's going to happen. If I get this far, because as said, like uh, the energy and tricks this guy has, the consistency, it's like, it's another level. <laughs> So I think the death blow is probably going to be the classic Merlin twist. I like the uh, idea of this trick because I've never seen it, I don't think, in Battle at the Barracks. Maybe like one front foot impossible or like nollie back foot impossible, but not the proper switch with the front side 180. I think this trick is pretty decent, although I know that Johnny has got it. I've seen him landed it a few occasions, and um, so this death blow might not particularly work on him. <laughs> we're here. It's finally happening. Right here we're in Switzerland uh, in our local skate park. Like we built this place and we are like so excited to have Jamie and his crew over. It's been a long time like working things out of like where we should do it, how we should do it, blah blah blah, but we decided um, Switzerland Johnny's hometown is a great place, location to do it. I've never been to Switzerland, this is my first time, so I'm super excited to be here, doing it here. It's a perfect location for it, really. It's been um, a nice journey. We traveled all the way from London to Switzerland, um, drove the van, shout out Ben from Half King for taking us up here. But yeah, it's been a nice journey, and we are finally making this game happen. I'm quite nervous, to be honest. Like, it's finally to go down. Uh, I've been waiting for this to happen for like one and a half years, I think. And I'm honestly glad for it to go down because like, I just want to have this weight off my chest. No, never been in Battle of the Barracks, but I've definitely kept up with it for like a long time. I think maybe the Pros versus Joes, Battle of the Barracks 7, is probably like the first one I was like watching every single game because I had a lot of like my favorite skaters in it, Johnny being one of them. And um, yeah, but no, never competed in one. So it's pretty amazing opportunity. It's been like eight years since pros versus Joes. So that's quite a long time. And I think ever since I improved a lot in like skating basics. And of course I learned a bunch of new tricks. Honestly, on uh, like a really good day, I think I could beat him. Uh, and and also if he's having like a really bad day. Like, I think that could happen, but he's honestly like really hard to beat. Like we played some game of skates yesterday, like just to get warm. And that was like, wow. I'm, I'm like blown away by his ability, what he can do on a skateboard. Like uh, it's such a pleasure to see him skate in real life. And he's also like super humble and everything. It's been so much fun ever since he got here. I mean, I don't know. I know I've followed Johnny for years. He's inspired me for years. I've learned a lot of new tricks because of watching him. So I don't know. I've never met Johnny before. I've never really, I've only seen him like through social media or whatever, but I don't know. We we'll, we'll just have to try our best, I guess. or see how it goes, have, have fun. Try to get some cool tricks. I'm just gonna try my best and make it like a fun game. There's like so much pressure on this one. It's like insane. Like the comments on my YouTube channel have been like all about this game for like one and a half year. And yeah, I'll try my best. I hope I will not let you guys down.